Ashtar was established to address a lack of teaching materials for advanced users of the Irish language, specifically translators and editors, but anyone basically who has cause to write the language at an advanced level. It has a wider public as well of people who are experiencing difficulties maybe in using certain words, they're unsure of grammatical structures and so on. This is the home page of Asher.ie, very simple uh, interface laid out in four sections. The first part we'll look at is Gaelge, which means from English to Irish. It's a, a series of translation exercises. The users are given um, a sample text that they have to translate into Irish. And when they finish that, they can go on to look at a series of notes on the exercise. Ashtar is unique to the extent that there is no other such uh, website. I think the most innovative aspect of Ashtar has to be that the material on the site, to a very large extent, is actually um, created or prompted by the users. They'll contact us by email and say, well, we have a problem with this word, this structure, and we'll try to write an entry or some sort of tra training material that addresses that. Users of materials as well in the universities and language classes tell me that they also appreciate the ease of it, that they'd previously been working with books and kind of fairly um, traditional materials. They can go to Asher, they can download the exercises. There's a great deal of ease about the site. The most interesting part of the site to my mind, uh, and the part which has most potential for development, is known as Crinus, which would be correctness or preciseness and uh, this is the most interactive part of the site because it's an alphabetical list of um, problems that people have with the Irish language, words which they find difficult, grammatical structures which they um, have difficulty using. Almost all of these have been suggested to us by users of the site. The feedback so far has been very positive. I think it's very attractive for teachers of Irish as well because the material can just be downloaded, copied and distributed to a class. There are no copyright issues. I was born and raised in Coleraine in County Derry. When I was growing up, I wasn't actually aware that there was an Irish language. We weren't told at school. I thought when I discovered there was a language, and I still think it's an absolutely remarkable thing, I think it's incredible that Irish people have their own way of looking at the world. The language was the oldest vernacular literature in Europe, an incredible uh, cultural resource. I enjoy the challenges of applying Irish to the modern world. I think its presence online is a real testimony to its adaptability. So this award, recognising the, the content of the site, is very meaningful indeed.